You know, I don't think they make this game tense enough. I don't think... I think if you're not having a heart attack 98% of the time, you're doing it wrong. Alright. What's behind the demon door number two? I'm running out of fuel! Start lighting some candles. There we go. Stop crying, lady! You're freaking me out. I don't want to be freaked out. And wait. Regarding explosive mixture. Okay. I prepared the explosives you need for cleaning the, fl the flood drain. I can't stress how important it is that the mixture is handled with care. Please try to tell your feather brain servants this before you go ahead with your plans. The liquids are not by themselves explosive and should be kept separated to avoid further mishaps. Two large vats in the next room for the ingredients. All you need to do is li mix the liquid and you're ready to go. And with care, so I can, I can blow the, the rubble out of the way then. But if the mixture is stuck, then I have a problem. So this left vat over there and right vat over there, with a stuck handle. So I could probably have to drill into the, whatever it is on the other one to make it work, right? At least that's what I'm guessing. The valve has rusted shut, so maybe all of them. But I need to finish the real. And is that blood? No, it's not. I'm getting mad. Shut door. Candle's lit. Okay. Ha! Huh. I'm not going to take it until I've explored the rest of the room because something's going to be evil and something's going to come in. Eat me. No? No? Really? Hand drill. Okay, good. 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 Good? Good. Ah, good. Yes. Okay, let's see. Use drill on this. Then use chemistry pot on this. Pick up partially filled pot. I wonder if when I fill this and something comes after me, I run and it explodes. Hmm. And that wouldn't be nice. Right, let us not murder ourselves. Picked up explosive. How does it say how dangerous it is? A highly volatile mixture. What's wrong with you? Why have you got a slight headache? Surely it's fine. There's nothing wrong. We shouldn't be panicking. Am I correct? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Why do the doors open outward? You know when it's just going to be one of those days, don't you? That's not even the right way. I need to go that way. Towards the evil things. Towards that door that I am worried is going to fly open when I go past. Let's get the living bejesus at me. It's going to be the eternal darkness bathtub all over again. I'm watching you, door. I'm watching you. That should be alright. Wait, have I got to set it off? Yeah, it's probably. It's just sort of standing there smouldering right now. What?
How do I set it off anyway? What have I got to set it off with? Hmm. Unless I throw something at it, since it's highly volatile. Bugger. I'd say that did the job. Oh yeah. Now I feel pro. And of course it's even dark at that. Ooh. Whoops. My bad. I haven't seen anything for a while. This bothers me. Because something's going to happen. Ah, blood. Of course. My day was going far too well for anything not bad to happen. Oh, you know what? Give me some meat. Give me a hammer. I'll have these jokers sort out no time. Okay. Someone was harassing you, perhaps, young lady? Or as we call it around here, giving you jet? Food storage. Any goodies? Ah, there be flies over there. I mean, something's dead or half eaten. Oh, door. I'd ignore the scary looking door. Don't want to know. Okay, is that what? Three doors off this room? What do you reckon, guys? First door? First door it is. Okay. Nothing else in here. It's light outside. It's not scary, it's light. Yeah. Oh, Christ. I think you can see me. Oh, God. Go away! Shoo! Shoo, you horrible abomination! Shoo works!
Lovely. Is he gone? I think he's gone. Okay, I think he's gone. This is only gonna get worse. I'm running out of oil. Oh god. Yeah. I know how you feel. But I'm still gonna have to do it, Dan. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> if a full set of three rods is unavailable, there is one rod in the inner study rooms which might work in case the elevator breaks down again. Unless it's absolutely necessary, always use the spare rods and storage before using a mended one. Problem number one. Gotta get out of here. Problem number two. There's a big fat naked dude with half a jaw hanging off. That's gonna stop us. Problem number three. This is a little bit tense. Is that real or is Dan saying things? Imagine it's fairly real. I guess we should venture out, huh? 